Hi all and welcome back to my very first Let's Play of Sea of Stars Part 4. And we will get cracking as soon as possible. But before we do that, I just want to say that if you're enjoying this Let's Play or the channel, I would love it if you hit those like, subscribe buttons. And for those of you who just did, thank you very much. And for the rest of you, we are past it now. And as usual, I will only be reading dialogue and information during the game. are starting to move. 2. I am eager to see what these two can do. 4. Eager and impatient too. 1. For now we wait. 1. 3. You know what to do. Merchant, hey there. Were you looking for anything in particular? Valuable meant to be sold. You caught a lunar trout. You caught a man of war. Shrine. 
It's locked. Mountain Trail. All right, we made it to the mountain trail. So far, so good. So the elder mist lives somewhere here, huh? I really hope we'll get a chance to return to Moon Cradle after this. What if we're sent out into the world right away? Yeah, I don't know. I just wish Scar was here. We could certainly use some Celestial Willow Jam to go with this awful bread. Haha, <laughs> the dream. Huh? Celestial Willow Jam? I got some right here, guys. I even picked some mushrooms. You won't believe this soap I'll make. Oh, and I found some herbs in the forbidden cabin. They'll do just right. Carl? What? You didn't really think I was going to let you go on an adventure without me, did you? Carl! Haha! <laughs> It's so good to see you two again. You look so strong now. Hey, why didn't you show up for our departure? Are you kidding? There was absolutely no announcement. As soon as I heard everyone gather, I went to our hideout, packed my stuff, but you left so fast. Guys, I'm so pumped for this journey. I know all about survival now. Fishing and gathering and cooking and... Uh, well, you had to actually come with us. You was a goodbye, but on duty now, and it's pretty dangerous. You can't mean that. You always talked about how we'd all leave together after your training. Um, plus, I spent all those years practicing in our little cave. I'm ready. Hmm. Look. I may not have any special powers like you do, but I'm built strong and I've been preparing. This here is my shield. I'll be a defensive fighter. Nope, a warrior cook. Oh yeah? Sure am. And I've been reading a lot too. See, most of the monsters you're going to face won't even be flesh mans or minions, which means anyone can fight them. You sure about that? Totally. You haven't seen any yet, have you? No, no, but I'll know when to step aside, don't worry. Plus, you can't really travel the world with just a few sandwiches. What were you thinking? That's, uh, uh yeah. See? You need me. You just do your solstice worry duties and I'll keep your bellies full. Carl. Deal? Okay, deal. Oh, I am so happy. No way, this is awesome. <laughs> Alright, I'll start the kettle. We have so much catching up to do. Garl the Warrior Cook joins the party. And so apparently, after we meet this Elder Mist, we'll be able to use magic without using magic and be sent out into the world. That's all we've been told. I guess finding our own way is the final step of training. Our first assignment is to get to Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. Wow, that's a lot. Your powers sound so cool though. Can't wait to see them in action. How about you, Garl? Oh, it was a pretty 
It was pretty uneventful, to be honest. All I did was train and learn the skills I thought would come in handy. Every single day I was hoping to see you come out. I'm sure glad no one told me it would take 10 years. Yeah, we miss you too. It's not fair that we were together and you had to do this on your own. Well, we're all together now, so it doesn't matter anymore. And I can't wait to explore the world. I want to taste everything. Hey, this soup is unreal, by the way. Right? Uh-huh. So how much food did you pack? Just enough for a few meals. It's better to travel light, and there's ingredients everywhere if you know how to look. And who knows what we'll find? It's all part of the adventure. Why don't you try it now, Valer? See that bush right there? It's full of juicy berries. And all you have to do is pick them. Didn't feel right without Carl. Perfect. Now we'll make some jam with the berries you picked. Just interact with the campfire and get ready to cook. Campfire feels cozy and warm. Cook. Okay, let's see here. Plus 5 MP to allies. Sweet and simple. Berry jam. I... Yeah. See? You're natural. We can eat that jam later when we need to heal up. Thanks for the tips, girl. That's going to come in handy for sure. Don't mention it. Hey, I'm ready for some sleep. Same here. And nothing but the stars above us. I'm loving this life already. Carl, I'm really glad you're here. Haha. <laughs> I was just about to say that. Me too, guys. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Well, good night then. Good morning. You all ready to go? I'm excited to see what this Elder Mist looks like. Should be straight up. Let's keep hiking. One abacus. Displace non boss enemies HP in combat. Base karma.
Were you looking for anything in particular? Here, I'll teach you some tricks. Roast sound. Carl hurls an enemy to another position if possible. Thank you. 
Huh? Recipe should great. As good as the pepper you grind into it. Physical damage, plus three physical defense, plus two magic attack, plus three magic defense. Plus two magic attack, plus one mana points, plus three magic defense, plus eight hit points. Plus 3 physical defense, plus 80 points, plus 2 magic act, plus 3 magic defense.
What could this be? Stolces have come for the right of passage, but I also sense one who does not belong here. Ha. Is he brave or foolish? Oh, let's find out. Elder Mist, welcome young adventurers to this sacred pond. Nice to meet you, Elder Mist. My name is Carl. My, what a gregarious one you are. Enthusiasm is certainly welcome in this place of meditation, but its rites are not meant for the common folk. Um, children of the Solstice, step forward. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! It seems you show great potential indeed. Have you weaved your will into celestial fabrics? We have, Elder Mist. Then come closer and let them be imbued by the sacred pond's magic. Oh, a tremendous resonance. Wear them with purpose. They will augment your innate magic. You should henceforth have light in the darkest places and protection against the minions of the Fleshmancer. I don't feel any different. Yeah, me neither. Oh, rest assured, the ability to use magic without using magic has taken root in you indeed. What does that even mean? And how does it work? It arises from need. In the many battles that await you, Victory will often demand the use of more offensive magic than one can sustain through spells alone. That is why attunement to live mana is paramount. Live mana? Oh! It allows your attack to draw from the magic bestowed upon you at birth. And judging by the resonance you create, this power should even extend to your traveling companions. Ah! You are ready! Live mana will start manifesting for you the next time you enter battle. Are you ready for your final test? Elder Mist, I'd like to go with them. Hmm. Oh. The Elder Mist trials have never been undertaken by anyone but aspiring solstice warriors. But I want to go with them, please. Interesting. You're the first of the common folk to ever make such a request. Hmm. He sure is a peculiar one. No doubt limited when it comes to combat, but the warmth of his heart. Could he bring it back? Hmm. Perhaps we should try to find out. I will allow it. Alright, thanks, Elder Mist. Consider it a test of your ability to act as a companion to Solstice Warriors. I won't fail. We are ready. Then close your eyes and take a deep breath. Welcome to the Elder Mist Trials. To pass this final test, you must bring three big relics together by completing their associated challenges. The masters that will try to stop you are immune to physical attacks, and the use of offensive spells is prohibited. What? How then? Oh, that is why you must use magic without using magic. Live mana can boost your battle actions with a portion of your magic attack. Embrace this power and your training will be complete. Well, I have to try that. The trials of age. Should you wish to return for a while, simply close your eyes and concentrate next to where you just appeared. Godspeed. Elder Mist Trials. 
return to Mount Fame? Yes. And I think this might just be the place to end off this fun part. See you in the next one. Thank you for following along in my very first Let's Play of Sea of Stars. I hope you are enjoying yourself. If you are, I would love it if you hit those like and subscribe buttons. And if I saw you again in the next part. But for now, it is time to say bye bye.